Hello Gemini, I'm Susie from The Gift Road 2 and I'm here to read your cards for the week of the 28th of March. So Angel, Spirit, Guides, Universe, what would you like Gemini to know about the week of the 28th of March? Or is the week of the 28th of March? Angel, Spirit, Guides, Universe, what would you like Gemini to know about the week of the 28th of March? Angel, Spirit, Guides, what would you like Gemini to know? Gemini, 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 Gemini. Gemini, 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 I'm Gemini rising, <laughs> angel, spirit, guides, universe, we have to talk, we have to speak, we have to communicate, angel, spirit, guides, universe, what would you like Gemini to know, Gemini, 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 angels, for the week of the 28th of March for Gemini, please. Week of the 28th of March for Gemini. This is my Mother's Day gift from my daughter. Angel Spirit Guides Universe. What would you like, Gemini, to know about the week of the 28th of March? This week of the 28th is very, very cool. Angel Spirit Guides Universe. What would you like, Gemini, to know? Okay, Gemini, let's have a look at what's on the bottom of the deck. Six of Cups, nostalgia, memories, thinking about the past and memories, going maybe going over old photographs or someone from the past is coming back into your life. Um, let's have a look. Eight of Cups with the devil. Right, okay, you're walking away. You've done too much in love or you've done too much drugs, rock and roll and sex. <laughs> you're walking away from something very toxic. You're, walking, you're cutting out this manipulator. Uh, it could be dealing with a Capricorn. Um, it, it might upset the family or this person or being this toxic has upset the family. Uh, you've got the Ten of Cups upside down. Um, there's like there's not the union that you thought you would get. Um, you might be feeling a little bit un... It's like you're not isolating yourself anymore. You're not waiting anymore. If you've not, someone's not talking to you. Um, it's like you might be, you just don't want to talk. It's, or someone just doesn't want to talk. And you don't want to talk to friends. Or you're sick of people gossiping about you. Um, and... You're making a, the, you're not waiting, it's just, it's, everything about this is, I'm not waiting anymore. Hangman versed. You're not taking time out. You're not taking time out to meditate. You've done enough meditation. You're walking away from this devil. Walking, she, she's walking down the steps. So, she, she done everything in love. She said, God, I've done everything for this person. I want him back, you know, in the six of cups, she's wishing he comes back and, you know, why can't he come back? And I wish I'd chased him away. Um, God, what do I do? So he says to her, well, you've got to walk down those steps. This is Persephone in Greek mythology. You've got to walk down the steps. And she's thinking, this. if I go down there, then I, I'm. that's hell. I, but she doesn't care. She's like, fuck it. I'm out. I cannot deal with this devilish behaviour. I don't want to drink anymore. I don't want to... This person's too, too drunk or that I feel like these puppets on a string. Um, it's too toxic, basically. I don't. Th there's no happy families here. It's upsetting the family. Uh, I don't want to wait around anymore for someone to talk to me because no one's talking. If they are talking, it's like I don't want to hear it. Gossiping. You could have a row with friends. It could be amongst a group of women. Um, and... It's like I don't want to hang about. I'm not going to see things from a different perspective. Um, you, you've got the Seven of Swords here. You might. Someone could be sneaking about. This is a. This is someone who steals things. Someone's stealing. Whether that's your energy or whether sometimes you've got you, the only way to deal with someone that's um, toxic or stealing or. or secretive is to be secretive yourself it's the only thing you can do so maybe you need to keep this a secret um you might be going away so it's like i can't it's like you don't want to be here you just want to move what you do 
So there is a lot of communication coming in. There's the swift arrows of love here. Someone is, wants to go away with you. You might have been going away with someone or booking a secret trip with somebody. And that's why you're um, being secretive or you're walking away. It's like you can't wait. Um, it's like you're not sacrificing anything for anyone anymore. It's not going to happen. It's you. There's lots of communication. You could be selling things online, but I think someone's coming towards you from abroad or you're travelling towards someone else, Gemini. Um, it could be that while you're travelling, there's a cancellation. Something blows up and it's the same position as Taurus had. Um, lots of communication. Something, and then something blows up. Don't take on other people's dramas because it could prevent you. Um, something at work. Something blows up at work with some maybe if you wait for goods to come in or for something to be delivered or someone to come up from abroad, there could be a delay. All right. So this four of wands upside down, there could be something in the in a team of people where someone gets can't make it. So or someone you love can't make it to you. Um because the Empress up here is upside down. And nobody likes to have the mother upside down okay nobody likes there not to be a harvest it's the earth it's the food it's the it's where everything comes from so there's something here between a house that's un, unearthed or a, a, a team of people that's um that doesn't bring in the harvest you it usually does and i think the reason is it's some kind of someone's making a decision here with the lovers it's your card gemini and you've got this king of swords here which is again your element which is the mind it's the fairness it might be to do with something to do with a lawyer a doctor or a military person and what they say goes now taurus did have this nine of wands and taurus did have the queen of swords at the end you've got the king of swords at the end so something legal here there's something legal to do with a house to do with a partnership to do with work that something at work isn't bringing in the harvest isn't bringing isn't so just when you think it's safe to go back in the water something happens it could be cancellation of a trip cancellation of an event someone doesn't turn up for work so then you can't get this abundance but there is a choice being made in love you are in your element you're in your element because what you see your choice is fair you're speaking your truth Someone is very fair here. Someone comes in to to tell the truth. It could be that something blows up. You're talking to someone online or whatever, and this sort of there's this trip, and you sort of just when you think it's safe to go back in the water, something comes up about the mother, or and you have to, you can't go to a house, or you something of an empress doesn't feel right she's not embodying all the queens she doesn't feel um like she lacks ideas or creativity uh, but there's something within this cancellation or this trip being cancelled or there's something that doesn't happen i don't get this contract there this might be a contract you don't have this partnership contract that brings in the lovers that brings in the choice of the truth in love that allows you to make the right choice. So what you think is a drama, I would say don't take on other people's dramas as well, so with that nine of wands. Um, have a backup plan if this people or this goods can't get to you or this, so this swift communication, someone's coming towards you and it's a clear stretch of fruitful activity, but something happens within a team or with the, with the mother that, makes you choose something different or someone different 
Just when they think it's safe to go back in the water, the lawyer rods. Run to see, look. Don't go helping someone else. Just get with this program. You might have to be, like I said, someone might be sneaking around. But it's almost like you might have to be secretive about this, this journey, this creative venture. Because maybe if someone finds out about it, they could spoil it. Or they don't want you to go on this trip. So they pretend they're sick and it's like, no, I'm, I'm out now. But you, it's like you're getting rid of a lot of things. A lot of toxic behaviour. Uh, forgiving and learning. As you release and heal the past, you experience more love in your present moments. Angel spirit guides for Gemini. What would you like Gemini to know about this week of the 28th? Week of the 28th. Reconciliation. Someone from your past is returning to your life. Angels. I said that with that six of cups on the bottom of the deck. Angels, spirit guides, universe. What would you like Gemini to know about the week of the not part to part conversations honestly discuss your feelings with each other there's lots of communication maybe with someone from the past that you have to be secretive about or there's a secret around it angels spirit guides universe what would you like gemini to know does this one want to come out let's just chuck it let it fall out angels <laughs> angels spirit guides new love a new person has stirred your romantic feelings gemini can't take all these but i will shuffle for one more angels spirit guides what about this new love what's going on here for the gemini 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 could be dealing with a libra could be dealing deception see someone is wearing a full self mask in this relationship <sighs> someone's connected to someone else you might know that or you are going to be with someone else because you're walking away from this manipulation or this devilish toxic behavior it might upset the a family ta uh, situation but you're not you're not contemplating it it's not you're not it's like you're not waiting anymore you're not even going to talk about it you're gone and you're not seeing it from anyone's perspective. It's like, I'm out. Yeah, I might have to be a bit secretive about it. And it might involve travel or go to someone from abroad. You're talking to someone from abroad. But this person or some drama might come up with the home or you lose your home or a contract of work. And the emperor is upside down. She's, she's, it's almost like all the queens are upside down. She's not in her element. She's not She's not feeling motherly. She's not feeling um, abundant. It could be something where you lose money this week because of this drama with this person or leaving this person or going elsewhere. But it does bring about this choice of love. You're in your element at the end of this week um, and you're speaking your absolute truth. Um, let's ask the... Angels, what they'd like Gemini to know. Angels, spirit guides, what would you like Gemini to know? It could be that you're just giving up um, drinking um, and you might have to go away to do it. Um, this might upset somebody, but it's, it's or, you're, or you're going to a job, it might upset the home. Gemini, Gemini, Gemini. Angels, spirit guides, what would you like Gemini to know about the week of the 28th of March, please? Clear your space, get rid of clutter, clear the energy around you and use Feng Shui. Angels, spirit guides, universe, what would you like Gemini to know about the week of the 28th? What do you desire right now? Visualise it and it will come about. Negativity will block your progress. So you've got to see a future where you're either clean, if you're if you're detoxing, or she's painting the, the flowers for, in her wedding dress. She's already designed the wedding dress. She's in the night. She's painting lilies. These are the flowers for her wedding. So it's manifesting the good times. Um, yes, the timing is right for this new venture. A happy outcome follows your positive expectations. So it's all about clearing away the energy of the past, getting out and doing stuff. The timing is right. Like I said, it's the t you're not waiting around anymore. You're, you're manifesting and visualizing the future. Try not to take on someone's drama. Someone could be deceptive here. 
and I've got codependency I'm looking at. Um, at the end of it, you, you, it's going to be fair. Whatever this lawyer says or the military man or, you know, the decision is made and this is how it is and it's balanced and that's how you like it, Gemini. Um, so, all in all, it turns out nice. Even with, even if this is upset, that this upsets the mother or the, the um, someone finds out they're not pregnant, you know, it's a pregnant woman, um, it's kind of brings the truth of a situation and it's balanced, it's fair, things are fair, okay? So take care, Gemini, the time is right for this new venture and I will speak to you soon. Please like, share and subscribe. Bye-bye.